Hey, everyone. My name is Matt Scales, and I'm with Google's Web Developer Relations team. I'm building a web app at the moment, and I'd like to share with you my process for building that app, as well as uh, talking about any problems that I have and anything interesting I'll learn along the way. So let's take a look at what I'm building. So here we can see a prototype of my camera app. On screen at the moment is the photos that I've already taken, as well as a photo I've imported. Uh, mostly my face, because that's what I have, have around when I'm developing. Um, and we have the ability here to either upload a photo or drag and drop it in, or uh, use the camera on the device to actually to take a new photo. Um, on a mobile phone, we're going to be adding in capabilities to do all of the things that your camera is capable of, like uh, firing the flash, or changing the ISO, or uh, changing where the focus point is on the screen. Uh, at the moment, I've only got the ability to uh, change the mirroring for uh, selfie mode. So let's take a photo. And now we're into uh, edit mode. And we have a fairly uh, standard set of filters here, things that you'd see in any uh, photo editing app. So we've got saturation. And I'm using WebGL to render the filter effects in real time as you move the slider. As we go on, we're going to be adding lots more features to the app. We're going to start by changing the camera settings when we actually take the photo. So we're going to be able to use, uh, on a mobile device, we'll be able to use things like auto white balance. We'll be able to use uh, change the focus point or actually fire the flash. Um, we're going to be adding in uh, new filters, as particularly like named filters, a set of filters where you, you click on it and it does a whole bunch of things all at once. We're going to try and make that really smooth and really fast. Um, and we'll be adding in uh, all of these things for video. So we'll just capture a video and then live preview uh, the video with the effects added uh, and create the output video there on the device. Uh, so if that sounds interesting to you, please join me again to uh, hear more about that. And thank you for watching. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to see more of our videos, click here and see you again. Cheers.